Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome if you are new here. My name is Louise Horn and I talk about all things skincare, hair care, makeup and sometimes clothing and so if that's the sort of things that you would like to watch then please do click on that subscribe button and also come and follow me on Instagram as well because there are things that I post up on Instagram that you're not going to see here up on YouTube and so today's video I'm going to take you through everything that I've bought at Cult Beauty. I got this big box delivered to me this morning and it was because I got an email from Cult Beauty yesterday morning saying that their goodie bag had landed and if you spend over £165 you can get the goodie bag for free which the contents are worth over £270 I think it is and so yeah I went onto their website straight away and had a look at the things that I wanted to purchase and so yeah this video I'm going to take you through everything that I chose and yeah the delivery came so quick so yeah I ordered this yesterday afternoon and it came by about half past ten this morning and so yeah their next day delivery service is fantastic it comes next day which is really what you want but yeah I thought I will show you guys what I chose now the box is full of this black paper and so I'm going to show you guys what I bought the first thing that I chose was this Cult Beauty starter kit I think it was. I saw this on their website a few months ago when it originally went onto their website and I was absolutely gutted that I didn't manage to grab hold of one of these because yeah it went out of stock really really quickly. Now the one thing that I really really wanted that was in this little start kit was something by Glow Recipe and so yeah I will show you guys what's in this little kit. So that's what the little box looks like. You get the little leaflet taking you through the products that you get inside your box. But um, this is all the items that you get inside the starter kit. Now the first item I'm going to show you is the one by Glow Recipe. This is their Watermelon Glow Sleeping Mask. I think the packaging on this is really, really cute. I will get this open and I will show you what it looks like. It's so cute. So yeah, that is the packaging. I'll just show you if it's going to focus. So yeah, that's the packaging of the sleeping mask. Yeah, I have heard really good things about this mask on the Beauty Within channel on YouTube and so yeah, I really wanted to try this. It is really hydrating because it's got hyaluronic acid in this little mask and also it has got AHAs in here as well which are alpha hydroxy acids which help exfoliate the, um, the surface of your face and so yeah, you can pop this on on a night before you go to bed or you can actually use this as a 10 minute mask as well. This brand and this mask are on my brands that I would like to try in 2020. And so yeah, that's why I really wanted to get this little um, starter kit because this is the thing that really attracted me to that little set. So yeah, that's the first item in the set. Now the second item that I'm going to show you is another item that I was really, really pleased was in this little beauty set and was the thing that attracted me to it and that is by the brand Huda Beauty and this is their Topaz Obsessions eyeshadow palette. Now I haven't got an eyeshadow palette by Huda Beauty and so uh, yeah when I saw that this was in the starter kit I thought yeah I really really want it and so yeah it has got a little mirror as well and those are the colours of the eyeshadows. I think they are so pretty. I do love a uh, orangey brown goldy tones and so yeah that is so so pretty I really like that so I'm really pleased that I've got a little Huda Beauty little eyeshadow palette. Now the next item 
is by the brand The Ordinary and this is their Alpha Arbutin 2% and Hyaluronic Acid. Now this, if you have a little look in the leaflet, it says that it is high performance skincare with a prohibitive price tag. The Ordinary Gel Like Serum targets hyperpigmentation and dark spots with a high concentration of melanin inhibiting alpha arbutin for effortlessly even brighter skin. Now, I'm really wanting to try and get rid of some of this hyperpigmentation that I've got on my skin. I have got quite a few little dark spots from when I have had a few breakouts around my um, my jaw line and also I've got this massive spot now I don't know where this has come from this just popped up yesterday and so yeah I'm sure that is going to leave a little uh, mark as well and so yeah I um, am quite interested to see how this works and uh, it is in just a little dropper bottle which I absolutely love a good dropper bottle but yeah that's what the product looks like so yeah I'm really pleased that I have got that little serum so the next product is again another product that I'm really really interested in and it's by the brand NARS and this is their The Multiple and it's in the shade Orgasm and let me just open this up for you so that is the packaging which it's really sleek and it's like a matte finish and yeah really really cute packaging and what this is let me just open it up it is in their um, orgasm shade which is a lovely pinky color with a bit of like highlighter glittery type ness in the um in the product but this is something that you can use on your cheeks and your lips and let me think it says a brand that needs no introduction nas is found in every makeup bag you'd care to rummage through a convenient does it all stick this best selling hue flatters every complexion uh, uniting the prettiest coral, pink and gleaming golden tones to lend a ultra subtle wash of creamy colour. Now I do think that you can put this on your eyes as well I think, definitely on your cheeks and on your lips but I'm sure that this is like a three in one product but yeah I am looking forward to giving that a try. Now the next product is by the brand Living Proof and this is their Restore Mask Treatment. Now I have used this mask before on my hair and yet yeah, it is a nice mask. I wouldn't go out and purchase the full size but I will use this little uh, deluxe sample size but what it says is after shampooing apply generously roots to ends and leave on for five minutes and then rinse and so yeah a nice little hair mask treatment there. Now the very last item that's in this box is this that is from the brand Patchology and it is their Flash Mask Hydrate, which is a five minute sheet mask. And it says that it's informed by medical patch technology, Patchology specialises in maximum effect skincare with minimal effort. Making quick work of patched complexions, this SOS mask stars hyaluronic acid and vitamin B5 to enhance elasticity and deliver a swing of hydration. And so yeah, a nice little sheet mask. So yeah, that is everything that you get in the little Cult Beauty starter kit. And so yeah, for £30 you get six really good um, little products there and I'm absolutely loving the Glow Recipe, the Huda Beauty, the NARS and the Ordinary products. Those are the four things that really drew me to this little set. So the next thing is again by Glow Recipe and this is the Watermelon Glow Pink Juice Moisturiser. Again the little packaging is so cute. So I will get this open and I will show you guys the moisturiser, if I can get into it. That's it. So that is the moisturiser. I am such a 
sucker for little miniatures. I absolutely love a little miniature and yet the packaging is just so cute. I think it is such pretty packaging. I think people would just buy this moisturiser for the packaging because it is so pretty. So this moisturiser I paid £19.50. Now the Cult Beauty website says that it's 20ml but you do actually get 25ml in this little bottle. Now this moisturiser is on my brands I want to try in 2020 and the actual product that I want to try because what drew me to this moisturiser is that it is supposed to be really lightweight, it's not supposed to clog pores, it is supposed to be full of vitamins and antioxidants and amino acids and so it's supposed to be really good for your skin and the watermelon is supposed to be really good for soothing skin and I do have sensitive skin and so yeah this sounded like it would be right up my straight so yeah I'm really really chuffed that I've got that little uh, moisturiser. Now the next product that I chose was by the brand Fresh and this is their Soy Face Cleanser. Now this 50ml little tube of it is £11.50 and it says that it's for all skin types, it's rich in amino acids and it gently cleanses face and eyes. Now this I really wanted to try, it is on my brands that I want to try in 2020 and specifically the Soy Face Cleanser just because I have heard so many good things that this is a really nice cleanser to use. It's got no fragrance in it and it says that it won't strip your skin but it says on the back Fresh Soy Face Cleanser for all skin types is an extra gentle gel cleanser that instantly whisks away everyday impurities and makeup, even mascara, without stripping the skin of essential moisture. The multitasking formula also works to tone, soothe and soften the skin for a radiant, healthy looking complexion. So yeah, that sounds amazing. I cannot wait to try this cleanser. So the next product that I got is by the brand The Ordinary and this is their Niacinamide 10% plus Zinc 1%. Now Niacinamide is a really good ingredient for people who have got oily combination skin because it helps to regulate your sebum production and um, yeah it's good for helping to combat blemishes and to help reduce the look of your pores and because I have got quite enlarged pores on my nose, my chin and my forehead that's one of the reasons why I thought I would get the niacinamide serum by The Ordinary because yeah I have heard really good things about this serum. I did get this and it was fine pounds. Now this is what the bottle looks like which is just a, um, a very similar bottle to all the other The Ordinary Serum bottles but yeah I do like a little dropper and so yeah that is the Niacinamide Serum. So the next product that I got is again by The Ordinary and this is their Buffet Serum. Now this is full of peptides, it has got amino acids in here as well and it's got hyaluronic acid. So yeah, really good for anti-aging. It's um, It will help you plump up fine lines, it will help you to produce collagen so that you've got that bounce in your skin and uh, yeah make your skin nice and thicker and plumper and yeah real good things and so that's why I thought I would try this because yeah really good anti-aging benefits but uh, I will show you the product so that is what the product looks like same as the other bottles really. I do like a nice little dropper and so yeah that is another little serum for me to try. Now the next product that I got was by the brand Indie Lee. Now this brand again was on my brands I would like to try in 2020 and this product is one of the products that I listed as what I wanted to try and so yeah this is their um, 
CoQ10 toner and this is to rebalance and prime and what it says is hydrate and rebalance your skin's pH level with this hyaluronic acid and aloe vera based essence alcohol free and formulated with antioxidant CoQ10 and sage this non-drying formula leaves skin primed and protected from pollution and environmental aggressors and so yeah this little 30ml bottle cost me £10 and I will just show you what the uh, little toner looks like so yeah that is the little toner and I will just show you the packaging now the next product again is by Indy Lee and this is their brightening cleanser and this says that it is to strengthen and protect and this was £10 so it says gently wash away makeup and impurities with this antioxidant rich formula strawberry seed oil hydrolyzed wheat protein and tomato extracts help strengthen firm and protect leaving the skin hydrated silky and luminous doubles as an exfoliating mask if left on for five minutes before rinsing and so uh, yeah this was one of the products that I wanted to try in 2020 and so yeah that is the little brightening cleanser and so yeah I will just show you what the product looks like so yeah that's what the little packaging looks like so um yeah i'm really looking forward to trying all of these products i can't wait to do my shop my stash video which i will choose all the products that i'm going to be using over the next couple of months now the next product that i got was by the brand pixie and this is their rose glow mist now i paid 16 pounds for this and what it says if i can read it it says this dual phased elixir is packed with essential fatty acids and antioxidants leaving skin with a natural glow it helps to moisturize skin improve elasticity and provide free radical protection and it says before makeup helps to calm create moisture barrier and smooth after makeup it sets adds a natural dewy finish and then any time it helps to moisturise, refresh and plump. And so yeah, that is that little rose glow mist. So I will show you the packaging. I do love a, um, a rose mist. And so yeah, I can't wait to give that one a try. Now the next product is again by Glow Recipe. This is their Blueberry Bounce Gentle Cleanser. Now, this is 30ml and I paid £10 for this. So let me open this up and I will show you what it looks like. If I can get into it. So that is the packaging. I think it's so cute I do love a nice little miniature so this cleanser is antioxidant rich so it will help you fight off free radical damage it has got hyaluronic acid in here to help you hydrate your skin and it has also got two different types of alpha hydroxy acids in here as well it's got glycolic acid and it's got lactic acid as well just to help exfoliate your skin now you can use this as a normal cleanser or you can leave it on your skin for five to eight minutes and use it as a deep cleaning mask as well and then just rinse it off after the um the five to eight minutes and so yeah i think that sounds really really good and i do love the packaging i think the packaging is just amazing i love the packaging of the glow recipe i think they are just so so pretty i think it is really really cute but yeah that's the little cleanser by Glow Recipe. Now the next product that I got was again by the brand The Ordinary and this is the Rosalic Acid Suspension 10%. Now the reason why I bought this is because I've been using the Paula's Choice 10% Azalic Acid Booster and I've been really enjoying using that but 
their full size product is £37 I think and this was £5.50 so yeah a lot cheaper. Now azelaic acid it's a antioxidant so it will fight against free radical damage and it is also a really good ingredient for dealing with blemishes and it will brighten your skin tone and it's a soothing ingredient as well and so it is good for reducing redness and roatia as well and so yeah I thought I would give this a go because I've been really enjoying that Paula's Choice product but I just think it is quite expensive so when I saw this I thought I will give it a go but let's have a little look and I will show you what the product looks like. So that is what the product looks like. And so yeah, I just thought that I would give this a go and see how I like it. But if this one isn't as nice as the Paula's Choice one, I would go and pay the £37. But I just thought I would give this a go, seeing it as it is so cheap. And so yeah, I thought I would give it a go. Now the next product that I got is this little two-pack. You get the 1% retinol and you also get the Bee Hydra Intensive Hydration Serum Sample in here as well and so I will show you guys what the products look like. So yeah this is the retinol and this is a 1% retinol and um, I have been using the Paula's Choice 1% retinol and so I thought I will give this a go because Drunk Elephant is another brand that I really wanted to try in 2020. Retinol is supposed to be really good for anti-aging because it it uh, promotes cell turnover and it also promotes collagen production as well and so yeah it has had research backed up saying that this is really good for anti-aging and so that's why I thought I would give it a go and and yeah see how I like this retinol. You are supposed to use a retinol at a lower dosage. 1% is quite potent but yeah I've been using the Paula's Choice 1% and I've only been using it once a week and you are supposed to increase your tolerance of retinol because yeah if you have got sensitive skin you might find that you will get a little bit of peeling from when you are using a retinol but if you do experience peeling they do say just to uh, to don't use it as often as you are and so back off and if you are using it twice a week use it once a week or use it once every two weeks and just then build up your tolerance but in this little um, set you also get the B Hydra Intensive Hydration Serum and this is a little 3ml sample and I think that this is a hyaluronic acid serum and uh, so yeah I thought that that was really cute a little two pack and so yeah I bought this for £24 and so uh, yeah I um, I'm really looking forward to using both of those. Now the very last item that I bought was by the brand Fresh and this is their Rose Floral Toner. Now like I said before Fresh is one of the brands that I wanted to try in 2020 and I specifically wanted to try the rose toner that's got the rose petals actually in the toner but yesterday when I was looking at the ingredients I did notice that that one had fragrance in it whereas this one doesn't have fragrance and yeah I'm wanting to steer away from fragrance in skincare because yeah I have heard that it can sensitise your skin over time. Now I paid £12 for this little 60ml toner and yeah I, um, I'm really looking forward to giving it a go because like I said I do like a rose little mist. Now this is supposed to be really nourishing for your skin, it's supposed to balance your skin as well and it is supposed to calm skin and so yeah it sounds really really good so I'm really looking forward to giving that little toner a try but yeah that's the last item that I purchased and then because I spent over £165 I got this little bag completely for free which has got £270 worth of products in here. Now I'm going to go through this 
quite quickly because I'm just conscious that I have just gone through all those products and yeah I don't want this video to be too long so yeah I'm just going to quickly go through all these products. So the very first item that actually attracted me to this little um, offer was that you get a full sized Summer Fridays R&R &R mask and yeah I've been wanting to try this. This is on my brands I would like to try in 2020 and specifically this R&R &R mask and so yeah really really chuffed that I'm going to be able to try this because this full size product is £45 I think and so yeah I can't wait to give this a go so yeah that's the first item so the next item is by the brand The Inky List and this is their Retinol Face Serum and it says it's ideal for all skin types, it's got 1% um, stabilised retinol compound, it's got half a percent of grown active retinoid without irritation, it's got squalene in here to help hydrate and protect the skin and it has got a slow release formula to help avoid irritation. And so this is what the product looks like. And so yeah, I'm really pleased that I've got another retinol product to try after I've used my Paula's Choice and then my uh, Drunk Elephant retinol. I've got my Ink List retinol as well. The next product that I've got is by It Cosmetics. Um, actually, I'm not sure if it is called It Cosmetics. It just says It. So anyway, this is their Confidence in a Cream and this is a Transforming Moisturising Super Cream and uh, yeah, apparently it is anti-aging, rejuvenating concentrate and so yeah, this is a little 7ml sample size and that's what it looks like. So yeah, a nice little moisturiser. Now the next item is by Iconic London and this is their Lip Plumping Glow. And so this is what the product looks like. I'm not really one for lip products to be honest, especially like liquid lip. But I do like the colour, I think that's quite nice. But uh, I'm not sure if I will be using that. But yeah, that is the Iconic Lip Plumping Glow. The next item is a little fan brush. This is by Zoeva. Um, don't really use fan brushes. But yeah, that is a uh, little Lux fan brush. Now the next item is by Drunk Elephant. This is their F Balm Electrolyte Water Facial Mask. And so yeah, this is another product that actually drew me in to get the little freebie. And yeah, like I said before, Drunk Elephant is one of the brands that I want to try in 2020. And so yeah, I have got a little uh, water facial mask as well. So that's that one. I have also got this, let's see. Perfect Shine Clarifying Scalp Scrub and this is by Nature Lab so that's that product and this is just a little 44 gram little sample size then I have got a 111 Skin Harley St. London Biocellulose Facial Treatment Mask. So the next product is by the brand Venifect. This is their pore minimising cleanser and it says this multitasking gentle foaming gel cleanser with willow bark, soy and pomegranate whisks away everyday impurities, removes excess sebum, reduces the appearance of pores and infuses skin with nutrients and essential hydration. And so that's what that little product looks like. Then the next 
thing is by Dr. Barbara Sturm. This is the hyaluronic acid and this is 5ml. Now, I had a look at how much this full size is. It's like £235, so this tiny little sample is worth something like £35, I think it was. And so, yeah, really expensive um, serum, even though... I'm told that hyaluronic acid is a really cheap ingredient and so um, they do say that it shouldn't really be an expensive product. But yeah, hyaluronic acid serum by Dr. Barbara Sturm. Then the next product is by Terry. This is their um, Growth Booster Mascara. Let me just grab this and take it out of the packaging. If I can get it out. No, it's not. Ah, oh, there we are. So that is what the mascara looks like. And I'm not going to take it out and show you the wand because I've got so many mascaras. And when you've opened it, you need to start using it. And so I'm going to leave that until... I am at a point where I can use a little mini mascara. So yeah, that's by Terry. Then I have got a little glow recipe, watermelon glow sleeping mask. And so yeah, this is just a little 10 mil sample. The next product is by Charlotte Tilbury. This is a hot lips. And, oh, it's so cute. Look at that packaging. It is so cute. And then, that is the colour of the lipstick. Which is quite a nice colour, actually. I do like that. I will probably get some use out of that little lipstick. Yeah, I do like that. And it's so cute. I do love a little miniature. I am a sucker for a little miniature. Now the next item is by Gold Fadden MD. This is the Wake Up Call Overnight Regenerative Regenerative Facial Treatment. And this is a little 12 mil sample size now i have used this before i've got a little sample size of this on the feel unique pick and mix service and so uh, yeah it is a nice little overnight treatment so i'm glad that i've got another one of those now the next item is by the brand emma hardy this is the protect and prime spf 30 it says that it's a lightweight hydrating and protecting daily moisturizer it smooths and primes the skin for a soft focus luminous finish and it provides uva and uvb spf 30 protection and so yeah that is that little sample size now i have had one of these before from the feel unique pick and mix and this size i think is something like 15 pounds and so yeah, that is another little um, SPF 30. So the next item is by Disciple. This is their Dreamy Skin. And it says, Ultimate Skin Regeneration. Retinol reduces pigmentation, lines and pore size. It's deeply nourishing and radiance boosting. Now I do think that this is a facial oil. It says... Gently massage three to four drops into cleanse face and neck PM and then use SPF in the AM. And so, yeah, that is that little product. So that's that. Now, the next product is by the brand Kate Somerville. And this is their Exfoliate Cleanser. And this is their daily foaming wash. This brand and this product is on my brands I would like to try and products I would like to try in 2020. So, yeah, I'm really pleased that I got this. But it says how to use AM and PM. Use twice a day. Apply a small amount to wet face and neck and massage gently for 30 seconds. Rinse and gently pat dry for optimal results. 
use with exfoliate, exfoliator appropriate for your skin type one to two times a week. So yeah, that is a, another little cleanser. The next little sample is by the brand Dr. Dennis Gross and this is their Stress Repair Face Cream and this is a little 7ml sample and it says for AM, PM use and smooth over clean dry skin. So that is the little sample. So that's a little face cream. And the very last product that I have got is by the brand Milk and this is their Vegan Milk Moisturiser and yeah this is just a little pot of face cream and yeah it is a tiny little sample pot so that's that so yeah a lovely little moisturizer so yeah that is the very last product i hope you enjoyed this video if you did please give it a big thumbs up and if you haven't subscribed yet to my channel then please do click on that subscribe button and hopefully i will see you in my next video all right then thank you bye